What's up you guys? Today on my gorgeous model Lexi, I'm gonna show you guys how to get the topsy tail tuck. Now with this style, it's all about the texture. It's really important. Now Lexi has very fine hair, but we wanna create lots more volume and then definitely have it hold all day is gonna be key with the product we're gonna use. Let's get started. guys so I'm gonna show you guys for the first time ever my dry texturizing mousse now this is from air professional it's gonna be available October 2019 so what it is it's a dry shampoo foam marries a mousse so it gives you that grit and texture like a dry shampoo would and then it has hold like a mousse would it's actually infused with volcanic ash because volcanic ash is actually a natural oil absorber so I love it for prepping hair you can use on dry hair. Now we're just gonna shake it, get like a good sized dollop going on. Then we're gonna, going to just apply it all throughout her hair, really focusing at the roots, and then we're gonna blow dry it in. You could use a round brush if you'd like. I'm just gonna simply use my fingers and really picking it up at the root area. All right, so you guys can see how that really added a lot of texture. And if you would actually be here to feel her hair, it definitely is just a lot more gritty. Therefore, it's gonna hold a lot better and then really help us amplify this style. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna create two topsy tails in the back. Turn around, see all that volume there. So we're just gonna lightly brush through it, making sure it's tangle free before getting started. Pulling all the hair in the back. Okay, so now we're gonna take a small section of hair a couple inches away from the hairline back. Just take a small section with your finger. It doesn't have to be perfect. We're gonna do the same thing with the opposite side. Almost like a little square section. And now we're gonna take both of these sections of hair, pull it together, and we're gonna secure it into place by using a hair elastic. Now, before getting started, what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna just take the ends and create a topsy tail. We're gonna actually do that two times. Just pulling it through. So what I love about this technique is it doesn't look like much here, but when we really start distressing it, it's gonna make it look like a completely different style. We're gonna add some texture air by Air Professional. This is a texturizing spray that has mica and crystal quartz in it. We are just gonna spray our little twists and then go through it. And starting from the front here is take little bits of pieces, like almost quarter inch sections and really pinch and pull it. And having that texture spray in there is gonna allow this to have a little bit of like oomph to it so it's not gonna fall flat. It's actually gonna be a lot fuller. Again, she has very fine hair. A texture spray will definitely help add to that. So you can see, gave it a nice little twist. We're gonna do the same thing with the opposite side. Quarter inch sections, pinch and pulling it. So that's one topsy tail. Now we're gonna do another one. And this one, we're gonna take the hair that's below this one and not go farther back than our ear. We're gonna pull that hair back. 
I'm gonna leave some little bits around her face out for some softness. So grabbing that section and doing the same thing on the opposite side. Again, create your topsy tail. We're gonna go around twice. Now taking some of our texture air, spraying the twists before we start pulling it apart. Okay, you guys, you can see how that kind of created almost like a curly effect. Um, so now we're gonna create our tuck. I do wanna point out that it's a little noisy on my street right now. There is a lot of construction going on, so bear with me the next month. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, create a low ponytail. Okay, we're just gonna gather the hair, take an elastic, tie it in there so that it's all kind of constricted into that little pony. Before we move on, I'm just gonna grab little pieces from the ponytail, just these like little soft little guys because we're gonna curl those just to make it really kind of soft. So now we're gonna create our tuck. So before doing so, a little bit more of the texture spray, big surprise. And adding a second little elastic on the ends, that's just gonna really help um, allow all this hair to stay together. So now we're gonna tuck it into the second topsy tail. Before I do, I'm gonna pull a little bit of the hair out. Actually gonna use my unreleased hairspray coming out October 2019. flexible hold and we're just going to pinch and pull little quarter inch sections to create some texture. So now we're going to take the ends and it's going to flip into that second topsy tail. Pull it through. Spread it out. And you guys can see that the tail is over here of that ponytail. So we're actually just going to tuck it, kind of fold it in and bobby pin it right to the head. Slide in a bobby pin. You guys can see here, sliding it in. Securing it into place. Then we're gonna spread this hair out around it so you can't see that. Okay, so we're gonna take some hair pins now with the little, little delicate pieces here. We're gonna take the hair pin, kind of spread that hair out, grabbing on to kind of the edges and then pushing it through just to kind of close up that gap. We're gonna do the same thing on the opposite side here. So now what's really important with this style, so we have this beautiful texture going on through here. This looks a little too straight for my liking. A little bit more hairspray. Then we're gonna do the whole pulled up quarter inch sections. I love this trick. Just to make sure that all the textures match. It's also giving it a little bit more volume too. Now we're gonna take a one inch curling iron, adding a little bit of curl, pointing it down, adding a little bit of bend in the middle for some softness. Do the same thing with the little guys on her neck. And you're just holding it there just for a quick second because you don't want it to be too curly. 
Okay, to finish the style off, what we're gonna do is actually use a little bit of spray shine. That's gonna really help tame any flyaways or frizz. This is definitely um, by Air Professional as well. We'll be out soon. Spray it all over. And that is about it. So that is our easy topsy-tail tuck. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys soon.